Hey everybody, Ken Pierce here in the Golf Gym Studio. I'm going to show you a really simple drill, exercise, movement pattern that's going to get you feeling a really extended follow through. Really, really extended. So you're going to get the feeling of a good extended follow through. Feelings, nothing more than... Let's go. But first I want to tell you, I belong to a LinkedIn group, that uh, several groups, and they open discussions all the time about different subjects. And one came up that said, I want to teach my student how to pause at the top and how to get into the downswing position and then also to be in a correct impact position. And my first reaction was, uh, you can't teach those things. You can demonstrate the things and hope that the student repeats them, but they have to feel the different feelings of where they are at the top, where they are. You can get into a long discussion about, do you pause at the top, I don't know. But the big thing is, it all comes down to feeling. And once that feeling is ingrained, well, you're going to have the feeling. So you can repeat it over and over and over. So I want to show you this incredibly simple drill that I, that, that I came up with. I've not seen anybody else do it. But I want you to get in a good golf stance, and I want you to be an arm's length away from something about shoulder height. This is a little bit lower, but that's fine. You can do this like on the roof of your car or anything against, against the wall. but. Ideally, if you can just sort of tap something or have something here, get into a really good golf posture. That means nice flat back. I don't need to demonstrate, but into a good golf posture. And what I want you to do is take your, if you're a right-handed player, switch for a left-handed player. Right, your left hand here, just nice touch, nice straight arm in a good solid position here. And I want you to take your hand back just slightly, but I want you to bring your other hand out to where it touches here. And also what you're going to get to feel here is how your hips need to rotate to be able to get you to that position. All right, so let's, let's do it here. Start again. Start here, bring it back a little bit, move here, and then I want you to reach while still in a good golf position. Reach, 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 reach till your fingers touch. You see that position? Let's do it again. Reach here, start here, and then I want you to slide, 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 and as you open your hips, you're going to feel more and more and more rotation, and you end up with this drill right here, where most of your weight's on your left side, you've moved everything to the left side after impact, and here it is, feel it right there, okay? All right, great. Now, since we want to balance out the body, we're going to switch it the other way. Okay, as I said, in order to balance out the body and have that same flexibility on both sides, we're going to do the other side. So for right-handed players, you're going to put your right hand up on, on the roof of the car against whatever surface you can that's at, at least somewhere around this shoulder area high. Down here wouldn't work so well. I need it a little bit higher. So I want you to take your right-handed players, take your left hand, move it back, and then I want you to bring it up here, and I want you to slide, slide, slide till you get to your fingers and boy I'll tell you if you do this right in a good golf posture you're actually gonna feel a nice stretch through the hips you're gonna feel a great rotation in your shoulders and again do this exercise maybe six or eight times nice and slow and as you reach 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 you're gonna feel a great stretch along your hips, along your back, and in your shoulders. So try that simple exercise. I know you'll get the feelings. Okay, okay. I've got a little drill here that's just amazingly simple, but it's going to show you how to get where you, how... Okay, I'm going to show you a simple drill, but first I want to tell... Feelings, nothing. Yike.